you guys, Jason here from RPM, and today we're going to be talking about our Skidoo blow-off valve. Uh, we've done videos in regards to our silicone, and we mentioned our blow-off valve in that video, but on the Skidoo 850 turbos, we offer a blow-off valve kit. That kit does require at least a charge tube, so we have our five-ply, extremely heavy-duty charge tubes from RPM. And uh, what they have is a 25 millimeter blow-off valve port. If you have our silicone, you don't require to run a blow-off valve. You simply leave the cap in and you're good to go. If you do want to run a blow-off valve, this is it. It's a full kit. It has a boost reference line, uh, a boost reference port that is going to go after the throttle bodies. Super easy installation. It's got a filter, a snow filter, everything you need. It's a complete kit. So you're going to be required to have at least a charge tube. We do recommend the intake tube. Uh, these are both oversized five ply. The, the industry standard is four ply. Ours are five ply, extremely thick, extremely heavy duty. They don't they don't collapse. They don't break. So that's that. But this blow off valve is uh, is kind of key to the turbo surge issue that the Skidoo C BRP doesn't really like from blow off valves on any of their machines, uh, whether that's side by sides or snowmobiles. And what that does is it creates that turbo flutter noise that you hear when you chop the throttle on your uh, snowmobile. So a little bit of information uh, and some Q&A about our blow-off valve is uh, it does that. It's going to stop the turbo flutter, that little <laughs> noise you're going to hear when you chop the gas. And instead you're going to get a loud push noise. Uh, and that noise is really dependent on a few things. The Skidoo uh, boost ramp levels is it, dependent on altitude. So the higher you go in altitude, the more boost the machine is going to see and uh, boost pressure is going to dictate noise. So. A lot of guys are like, oh, what does it sound like? So our machine is on a stage two Ibex tune and we recorded it about 10,000 to 11,000 feet elevation. So it was seeing some higher boost levels um, and how yours will sound will be dependent on your elevation because that's going to determine your boost levels. And if you have a tune or not, that's also going to determine your boost levels. The uh, blow off valve is extremely helpful. It's going to stop the turbo flutter uh, recovery on RPMs and throttle response is going to be improved and you know you're going to be taking the pressure off of the uh, turbine wheel so that's uh kind of everything we have to say about the blow off valve if you have any questions feel free to reach out for, to us these silicone tubes and blow off valve kit are available on rpmsxs.com under our snowmobile section and uh you guys came here for the video and these are sound clips of the blow off valve in action <laughs>